we might be thinking we are here, steering wheel in our hand, driving in the direction we want to go, maybe a bit annoyed about what we see and others. But then maybe we see someone driving, very peacefully. Maybe we think they are enlightened, like the Buddha. We try to be like that, and fail, of course. And then we might see a non-duality speaker. They aren't in the driver's seat. How do they do that? We try to let go of the steering wheel. Surrender, let go. Our grip seems tighter than ever before. And then maybe a glimpse happens and we see that not only are we not in the driver's seat, but no one else is either. And it's obvious there's no advice that anyone could receive and nothing that anyone could choose to do. And then it's seen, but by no one, that there's actually no one in any car, and there never was. There isn't a you at any non-duality meeting. Even if someone speaks up at a non-duality meeting, they aren't there. All that's happening is a question and an apparent answer. It was funny recently listening to a podcast between a non-duality speaker and Sam Harris when Sam said, Well, yeah, I'm just saying, if you introduce me to a new Buddha who claims to be a Buddha, but they claim to feel shame all day long, I've got some questions to ask. (laughs) (laughs) And that's the old paradigm. A someone who needs to become thought-free, emotionally free, trigger-free. No, not enlightened. No, still not enlightened. When actually, non-duality doesn't recognise the person at all. It's pointing to an apparent happening as both a whole and as nothing. No real person in a car. Only an appearance of a car. Only an appearance of emotions or thoughts in an empty car. That you consciousness that we've been so sure is the tool to help us find an answer to self-realisation can only cut things up into things. It's been like turning up to a oneness meeting with a separating instrument and then complaining because everything keeps getting separated. But those separations are only illusory. Consciousness becomes relegated to that cupboard where we've stored that ab machine that didn't give us toned abs and the facelift in a bottle that didn't work and a host of other things that guaranteed and promised results that were also not forthcoming. This is your last non-duality meeting because you already aren't here. All that can turn up at the next meeting is no one at the next meeting. No Buddha with a realisation, no someone who can't be triggered, no new you. They'll just be the meeting. Ooh, fresh bit of nothingness. <laughs>